with Netflix becoming more popular by the day and streaming content, whether you've cut the cord with your cable company or you're just wanting to stream content on the go from your smartphone, it's really important to take advantage of a couple new features that Netflix has recently rolled out called Profiles and Facebook Social Sharing. Over the next couple of videos, we're going to look at just that. With Netflix profiles, what you're able to do is log in online if you haven't set them up already and add profiles for all the people in your household who use your Netflix account. So no longer will parents have to worry about their kids' shows showing up as recommended shows or kids won't have to worry about their parents' shows showing up in their recently watched. What you need to do is log into Netflix.com and if you're prompted right away, you can go ahead and set up your profiles there. If not, go to Settings, Manage Profiles and start adding the names or groups of people who watch content in your household using your Netflix account. So by combining both Netflix profiles and Netflix social integration with Facebook, you're able to not only keep your content separated, but you're also able to discover more content in a quick manner. I'm Jason Cipriani with Chieftain Tech Tips. Make sure to visit us at chieftain.com and read Tech Thursday every week in the paper.